Hi everybody, this is Mirav and today I'm going to teach you about redirects, how to use them. So this is one of the f many features of iJoomla SEO. You can uh, get there by clicking on redirects on the left or redirects here. So here we have an example that I already entered and I wanted to show you that you can do a redirect in two ways. And basically what a redirect means is that instead of sending your visitors to a site directly, you redirect them through a link on your site. And there's a few reasons for that. First of all, it will be allow you to uh, track how many people click on this link. Also, it will allow you to uh, add a nofollow to that link so that your site doesn't have too many outgoing links, which is not good for search engine optimization. Uh, all, all sort of uh, advantages for the redirects. So there's two ways to create a redirect. You can just copy the tag here and place it inside your content and that will use the name of the the redirect and it will link to this URL. The other option is to just create a link using this URL. So let's see what's going on if we click on it. As you can see I entered the name of the redirect so that I can identify it. I, I entered where I want it to link to which website or URL do I want a nofollow yes or no? Basically it means that Google, if it said to yes, Google and other search engines will not follow this link. So it doesn't, it doesn't, it's not considered as an outgoing link of your site. And the target means is it's going to open in a new window, current window, parent window, uh, top frame, etc. And the link text means what it's going to show on your content if you are using the tag like I showed you before. Now if you want to use an image, that will also allow you to select an image from uh, your stories directory. Okay, so let's take a look and see how we can use that. I'm going to use the first method, which means I'm going to copy this URL. Copy. And now I'm going to enter it in one of my articles, just to show you. So let's just open one of the articles. And now let's say I want to put a link here to ijoomla.com. And I want to link it with the redirect. So I highlight it. I click the link over here. I enter the URL here get rid of all the spaces if you have them. Same window, new window, I'm going to choose a new window because it's a separate website. Insert and apply. Now on the front end this is how it looks like. It says visitijumla.com and when I click on it it will take me to ijumla.com but it will not take me directly there. And that is the point of the redirect. So. Now if I go back to the admin and I go and I want to check how many hits I have on this link, I can I can do that now because it's going to track all the all the clicks to that URL. Here we go back to redirects. And you can see that we had one hit, meaning one click to this URL. So this is a great way to track how many clicks you have to different URLs, but also it's a good way to not have too many outgoing links coming out of your website. Now the other scenario is to just use this tag. So uh, I already entered it, just to show you really quick, I entered the tag here, and this is how it looks like on the front end. The word I entered before is showing up here, and it's going to sh show me basically a redirect to ijuma.com, which is what I entered. So there's two ways of doing it, and this is how you do it, and I hope you uh, find this helpful. This is like one of the small features of Ijuma SEO, but uh, uh, some people need it, some people don't. So use it if you want or not.